We'll guide you through how to blur a face in CapCut. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Open a project in CapCut and go and add the video. Now what you need to do is make sure the video is not selected. Go at the bottom and click on effects, click on video effects, click on the search bar and type in blur, just like so. There's a few options to choose from. I'll choose this one on the right here and we've now added it. Then I can press cancel and I'll press the tick. Now what you want to do is hold the endpoint on the blur and make sure the blur is the same length as the video and then click on the video and scroll along the options at the bottom until you see duplicate. Click there. Now with the duplicate selected, you then need to go and click on overlay at the bottom again and then click and hold on the overlay and drag it right to the start of the other video so they're matched. And then all you need to do is click on the duplicate and scroll along again at the bottom until you see the option for mask just here. And you can then go and click on circle at the bottom. I find it to be the easiest. In the bottom left, click on invert as well. And as you can see, we can then position the blur to be blurring the face. Now, when I play the video back, you'll go and notice my face goes and moves. So to keep up with this, we'll need to keyframe. Go to the right of the play pause button at the start and add a keyframe. And then all you now need to do is start moving the blur with the video. And a new keyframe will be automatically added as you started to add them. So then just keep moving the blur as needed. It's best to do it in smaller increments to go and make it more precise. After you finish, you can click on the tick. And now when I go and play it back, you'll see the blur follows the face. If you found this guide useful, then please leave a like.